Talking about your mental health is important, but it can also be uncomfortable to open up to others. However, hiding your feelings from others isn't always healthy when it comes to your mental health. Annually, one in five students experience a challenge with their mental health. It's not uncommon, but asking for help is far less common. So how do you ask for help? And how do you know when to ask for help? Here are a few things to consider. Recognize the signs. Some signs to look out for are excessive worrying, fear, confusion, low self-esteem, problems concentrating, and just not finding enjoyment in your usual hobbies. Knowing that asking for help is okay. Asking for help might be hard, but thinking about why it is hard might help. Some people's personal perspectives, cultural or religious beliefs may lead them to believe that they would be negatively judged for having mental health problems. This is called stigma and it can lead to people not getting the help that they need. Where to get help at Curtin? Whether you're an online or face-to-face -face student, there are many places to access personal support. The personal support webpage on Curtin's current student website is a fantastic place to get connected with Curtin's support services and resources. Curtin has a wide range of support and facilities available to help you during your time as a student. There are many areas of support detailed on these pages with further information, contact details and support resources available. There is also a portal for financial advice to help out with a range of issues. These issues include needing to look for a job or scholarship to assist tuition fee or obtaining information on housing and transport. Reach out for support if you need it because it is available. It might seem hard, but there is always someone to help. There is no shame in getting help. If you need help after hearing the issues raised in this video, head to Curtin University's emergency and after hour help page to get support from 24-7 helplines and services.